Welcome back guys, we got more hot deals on this episode coming up right after this. So for those of you that aren't familiar with what we do on the Hot Deals episode, I'm constantly on the lookout for excellent deals for those that are into photography or videography. And I know that a lot of this kind of equipment can be pretty painful in the wallet area, if you know what I mean. So I found some new deals for you. Let's get started. Okay, so first up, I've got my favorite light modifiers of all times. It's the PBL Photo Studio 42 inch reflective umbrella soft boxes. I have been using these things for probably like the last five or six years and I love these things. As far as the weight, the convenience, the amount of light, the softness, everything about these things are just awesome. Not to mention you can get two of them, not one light modifier, but two of them for the low price of $35.49. Every single time that mine start to look just a little bit worn or I've carried them around a little bit too long, uh, I just buy another set. I think I've only had to buy like two in the last five or six years. And I'm telling you, these are probably gonna uh, be some of the best pieces of equipment that you have in your kit. Uh, if you like soft lighting um, and you're trying to get into flash photography, get these things. Just pick these up right now. You will not be mad at me one bit for recommending these to you. Uh, like I said, you get two of them. It's got some inner uh, reflective material on the inside. Um, you can even use studio strobes with them. Uh, most of the time, I just put them on a flash stand and then insert my flashes directly into these things. Uh, if you happen to already have some stands, but you might need might need some uh, some brackets, you can buy these really cheap little brackets here for $5.39. As always, I'll have the links to those and the softbox umbrellas in the description box down below. Okay, so next up on my list, people always need power. We need lots of power. We don't ever want to be running out of power. We don't want our electronical devices to ever be without juice. So these are the Wasabi Power uh, battery. You get a two pack. Uh, these are excellent, excellent choices uh, for batteries, especially if you're into the Sony camera line. Uh, most people know that the actual official Sony batteries are going to run you somewhere uh, about 50 bucks for one battery, but you get two for half that price. Um, I happen to use these, and I also bought another set from, I think it's called Big Mike. Um, they're a little bit beefier than the um, the official one that comes with, say, like your Sony A6000, A5000, A5100. Um, so they do last quite a bit longer. I'd say that you're more than likely going to get, instead of 300 shots on the official battery, you'll probably get more in the range of 400, 450 shots with these aftermarket batteries. Absolute top-notch quality. I love these things. Uh, again, if you're into Sony's and you need some extra power, pick these things up. And even if you're not with Sony, you can still buy aftermarket batteries from Wasabi or Big Mike. You're not going to be disappointed in the quality, I can assure you. And for $26.99, bucks and 99 cents, it's half the price of one official battery. It's a no-brainer. And last but not least, I know that every single person, whether you do photos or video, you're going to have SD cards, compact flash cards, mini micro SD cards, whatever. You're going to need something to transport all of that external storage. And for my money, you honestly can't get much better than these small little Pelican uh, SD memory card protective cases. Now, these things are amazing. Um, if you do a lot of video work or photography work, you're going to have so much storage, it's not funny. Uh, I've got cards laying all over the place half the time, but when I'm ready to travel and I want to make sure that all of my data, all of those photographs are protected, then this is what I put it in. You put it in something that is water resistant, you put it in something that is shock resistant, something that will absorb uh, a drop. You don't want your cards getting messed up. There you go with the uh, micro SD and the standard SD, and then those, uh, I believe, if you turn them sideways, you can fit your compact flash cards in there as well. I have the one that's just all SD cards, but I figured that some, some of you might actually have the compact flash cards, so I'm gonna recommend this one. This is the Pelican 0915. That's about all I've got this week. I hope you guys enjoyed the show. And if you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up or not. I don't give a shit. Either which way, I hope you guys stop by again and come and see me. As always, thanks again for stopping here at the Photo Video Show. I'm your host, Mark Puckett. I'll see you guys again on the next one.